back to Tabletop CP in Game 3 of the Smolensk 1941 pint Size Campaign for Chain of Command. We'll begin with a quick recap of what's happened to this point. Uh, so July 29th, which was Game 1 and 2, in Game 1, Robert and his Soviets launched the attack onto Century Arcevo and were bloodily repulsed. And in Game 2, the Germans quickly followed up with an attack into Zaborye, which is on the... Uh, Soviet supply line and we won that game so we've cut the Soviet supply line and repulsed them on July 29th. This is game three, the start of July 30th. This game will be a, another German attack since they won the last game they have the initiative again so they will attack again this time into table 3C which is southern Zabor, or uh, southern Yartsevo and we're gonna see if we can clear all of Yartsevo and hold the Soviet supply line which will give the Germans a real upper hand uh, in this campaign right away. So today's board, as I just said, is table 3C, and it is a very flat, open board, mostly open. It's not as open as it may appear just at first glance, which we'll go over here in a second when we talk about the terrain. The map we will be using for this game is the Muddy Plains map by Geek Villain, which is perfect as this is a muddy, uh, swampy area. So um, as you can see, there is a lot of open ground, uh, but this patch here, this is going to be scrubland. So this is soft cover and it blocks visibility uh, within six inches. So it cannot be seen across, which is good for the Soviets, as we'll see in the deployment when we look at the uh, mission. But other than that, we have a large area of, we'll call it swamp. I think uh, in the book it's called water field or something like that. But it's essentially a big swamp here where this green lichen is. And this is going to be open ground and uh, difficult movement. There's another small patch of swamp there. And then we have one small patch of uh, woods, another small patch of woods, another patch of woods over there, and one small light cover house. The woods are standard rules, four inch visibility, soft cover. And the river itself is just a little uh, rivulet, they call it. And essentially a small stream. It's not gonna have any effect on the game at all. And that will do it for the terrain. Let's go ahead and talk about tonight's mission. Today's mission will see the Germans attacking Table 3C, Yartsevo South, from Table 4, using Scenario 3 from the rulebook, Attack and Defend. In the Attack and Defend mission, the defending Soviets will place four patrol markers within 18 inches of his table edge, and within 12 inches of at least one other friendly patrol marker. The attacking Germans will enter the board on the opposite side, on a broad front, with four patrol markers. The Germans will receive D6 free moves, before the start of the patrol phase. At the end of the patrol phase, both players will place three jump off points. For support, the attacking player will roll 2d6 and take that amount. And then both players will apply the force rating difference and any resource points they wish to spend. The Soviets, however, are cut off from their supply point and will not be able to use resource points. The attacker has no restriction on his support choices. The defender may not select a preliminary barrage among his choices. The objective for both sides is to drive the enemy from the field while keeping their own force morale at three or higher. And that will do it for the briefing. Let's look at the forces. We begin with the German force. This is a platoon from the 1st Battalion 6th Schutzen Regiment. They have a force rating of plus three. The CO's opinion for this platoon is plus three, which gives them a plus one to their force uh, support roll, or yeah, plus one to their force support roll. The men's opinion is plus four, which gives them a plus one to their force morale roll. And the personal opinion of the platoon leader is happy, which gives them no bonus. Commanding the platoon, we have young Lieutenant Jens Kopke. He is armed with pistol, senior leader. Assisting him is Feldwebel Luke Lankowski, the famous cabaret singer. Filling out the bulk of the platoon, we have three squads of Schutzen. These are dual machine gun squads. Each, uh, each uh, team consists of a machine gun team with three crew. One of them has two extra riflemen. One of them has one extra rifleman. And they're commanded by a sergeant junior leader with submachine gun. And then we have a five centimeter mortar with three crew. And that will do it for this platoon. Here we have a platoon of Soviet infantry from the 101st Tank Division. Their force rating is minus three. 
And the Soviets get a fresh platoon every game, so they're always going to be a full-strength platoon for every game. Commanding the platoon, we have young Lieutenant Asimov. He is armed with a pistol. And the rest of the platoon is made up of three squads of infantry. They are led by a junior leader with rifle. And they have one big squad, and it is a seven man or seven guys with rifles and a three man machine gun team. And then lastly we have another five centimeter mortar with three crew. And that will do it for the Soviet platoon. Alright, so Robert has arrived. He's been briefed. And we've done some preliminary bookkeeping stuff. So for uh, force morale, I'm at 11, he's at an 8. He's minus, he, he did roll a 2, but he got a minus 1 for his men's opinion. And I rolled a 5 and I had a plus 1 for my men's opinion. So that left me at 11 to 8 on force morale. Um, and as far as resource points go, we, re, we roll for those again at the start of turn 3. I got 11 more on top of the 4 I already had, so I'm back up to 15. Robert got 8 more on top of the 2 he had, so he's at 10 but cannot spend any of this game. So we are going to do the patrol phase. He's lined up all of his markers there. Yep. I have placed mine in a stack there, and I rolled five free moves. So I'm gonna to get to move the whole stack, and then one extra move. So I'll go ahead and do the patrol phase. Control phase is complete. Um, I have, well, go over on uh, Robert Sersons are a lot easier. He's all lined up here. That's really all he could get. He, could ne he never could squeak into that um, forest over there, so he's right up against the back edge. Meanwhile, I have one here. I have one here. And then I have one right there. Did you get the one in there? Yep. Okay. So those are my three. Um, we've rolled force support. And I rolled a five, and that means Robert gets half of that rounding down, so he's two, but our force rating difference is six, so he's going to be eight support points. Now I'm going to be six support points because the five plus the one for uh, my CO's opinion gives me six. So six against eight. So the attacking force has less support points, which is kind of, un kind of uncommon, but uh, not unheard of. So with that, what we'll do is we will go ahead and pick our support and do our plans. Start with the German plan. Um, so I have the six six points, which is not enough because I want to bring the char charbis uh, captured French tank. So I'm going to spend one support one resource point to bump myself up to that, and that's all I'm going to take. I thought about maybe spending more resource points. I got 15 of them, and bringing some more HE like a light howitzer or something. But uh, we'll just stick with the char B for now. I really could pour it on and bring another squad and all kinds of stuff and really just give him a hard time. But he's going to have a hard enough time as it is. Um, the way he's set out, he pretty much is going to be forced to bring hard cover for everything, which I think personally would be a no-brainer. But uh, anyway, we, we carry on. So my plan, the char is going to be coming in from there, obviously, the road on my edge. And I'm going to pack uh, as many squads as I can in here and just set up a base of fire. So the problem that I only problem I have is I can't see through this. So if he gets back here, I'm not going to really have line of sight to him at all, which means I'm going to have to come out. So that's where this jump off point might come in. Um, I'm, I did not bring a pregame barrage, so if he can start coming out early, I can see where he's going to go, and I can decide which of these two forests I want to try to pack with troops. Meanwhile, the char will be coming up. Um, yeah, it'll be interesting. Um, just, I don't know what he's going to do. I would bring a lot of hard cover and an extra squad if I were him, if I could afford it. And just put everyone in hard cover as close together as possible. And hope for some double phases. And just try to mow my guys down in a long firefight. But we know how that works against dual machine gun squads. It's not pretty. So, Anyway, that's my plan for what it's worth. Okay, so for support, I took three entrenchments 
a T26, and then two Molotov cocktails. I figure he's going to bring the Char B because he just painted it. And honestly, the only good bit of news for me on this is this batch of scrub, which blocks line of sight from six inches, which means I can basically deploy the infantry in here, deploy the tank early to slow him up and take attacks of opportunity, and then find a good moment to just drop all three infantry squads, target one, and just do as much damage as I can. That there really isn't much in the way of a plan other than that because I just don't have the resources or the command and control to do anything fancy. So that's it. Uh, the entrenchments allow me to deploy in the open in hard cover and not care. So um, just pick my moment, deploy, and do the best we can. Those are the plans, and let's we'll go right into it. So Germans will begin. One, two, two, three, four. So I brought in the Char Bis over here, went on Overwatch, and then I packed two squads in here, along with Cocky and the Mortar. So two, the two twos I brought the squads in, with the four I brought in Cocky, and with the one I brought in the Mortar. Now I forgot to say that I was going to spread those guys out like I usually do, so I'm just going to bring them in. Uh, he's got Cocky there, so maybe he can get some shots off, and that will do it for the German phase. Brand new Soviet dice, first roll. Hey, it's not bad. Yeah, a bunch of fours. <laughs> if you want to bring all your senior leaders in. So pretty much he just has a three to work with. Mm -hmm. Robert has brought in a T26. One of his support uh, units. What is that, four? Four points? Four right. points. Four points, all right. Uh, so that's half his points. And he is going to fire at the squad there on the far left. Yep, they're the only ones I can see. So he cheat. He cheat. Three hits. Three hits. In the open. Okay. Uh, do two on the left squad. Can I put them on the right squad if I can't see them? Well, I got two squads there, so yeah, four teams. Sure. Okay. So this is uh, on the left team, this is on the right team. Cool. Oh! Ooh, three dead. Yeah. No, two dead, one shock. No, that is a dead if it's in yeah. the open. You're in the open, three dead. Oh, damn. Hey, your tank finally did something. <laughs> See if it's the leader. It is. Which one? It's the little leader. Okay, and uh, what happens to him? Six. Uh, light wound. Okay. So he loses a command. Minus one. Okay, we'll figure it out. All right, that was good. He's finally killed the German in the third game. Oh, I've killed plenty of Germans. I just didn't kill enough for it to matter. Yeah, well, yeah, it was the force the force rating difference yeah, was always. Yeah, that's always what killed me. The force morale difference. Okay, so I got a five... Three, three, four, four. Char moved up uh, quite a bit. This little chunk of um, scrub here is blocking my sight. The squad that just got nailed by the HE shell just pulled back. He can't see this one. He can move up, I guess, but it'd be kind of dangerous. And I think that's all I'm going to do. So we'll go ahead and move on to the next phase. Double phase. Double phase, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Oh, I can activate the tank. Yep. The tank is going to move 1d6, and if he's got line of sight on that squad, but is out of sight of the char B, he's going to fire. All right. The tank moved up. Uh, he was able to get it so that he's just past this from my tank, but he can see two guys on the end of my squad over there. Fire an HE shell. Three hits. It's like deja vu. <laughs> we just had this. <laughs> and they're in the open. <laughs> Man. Two dead. <laughs> Damn. Not, Not the a leader. leader, though. Okay, so I've lost five dudes. And it's got to be those two guys uh. in the end because they're the only ones I can see. Yeah, all right. Next phase. Six, five. That's not bad. Six, five, one, two. Mm -hmm. And activate the tank. Okay, four rounds of HE at the guy with pointing with his finger. Uh, two hits. Two hits. One dead. Uh, another dead. Yeah, damn. This tank is kicking my ass for now. All right, so that's it. So it'll be my oh, phase. Uh, no, oh, I can still get to pull back. Pulling back. An inch. Okay. We'll uh, move out. Here we go. Double phase. And <laughs> no three. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay. Uh, well, I have nothing to... Do I have anything to do? Not really. 
We'll just move into the next phase. Okay. Okay, there's a three. One three. And two ones. Brought my tank up and at an angle, so now we can see over this direction. And that's it, so Soviet phase. Those new dice you brought. You bought new dice. I, well, you told me to buy new dice. Uh, you have to. <laughs> it was not pretty Three last time. Three fours and two. I oh, can't do anything ones. with the tank. Can't do anything with the tank. Okay, but again, three fours. So. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. Nothing really to do there. Another chain of command point. One, yep. one, two, three. Here we go. Uh, tank is going to fire and move. So this thing has a small turret rule. So if the commander activates, he can only fire the gun. But if you get ones, you can use those to activate other positions in the tank. So I'm going to fire the gun with the leader. He's a one to move, a D6. And then meanwhile, this squad that was back there has moved up tactically back into the woods. And here we go. So needing a five. Yeah. Uh, I got a five. Okay, we'll have to figure out. Uh, you are. We'll have to figure this, uh, this out. The hit, my AT with the main gun in the turret is a five. I got two strike. Two. I got one save, one. so one net hit. So roll a D6 for me. Three, or two. Two. That's probably not horrible, right? Uh, where the hell is it? Oh, one net hit. One shock gunner may not be activated next phase. That sucks. That is bad. That okay. Is very bad. And. And then I'll move a D6 up, four inches up, and that'll be it. Soviet phase. I got a three. There's a three. Yeah. One, three, three, four. Yep. Six. Robert has moved up uh, nine inches. So he's mm -hmm. now back again behind the scrub, and he's not going to bring anything else in. Okay. One, one, three, four. Yep. Tank has moved up, and then Kopke put the other squad that had moved up last phase on Overwatch. So I'm back in the woods on Overwatch after losing five or six guys <laughs> mm -hmm. to the random T26 HE shell. Yahtzee. One. Okay, there we go. All right, he's going to fire the tank and then move it two inches. I hit you. Okay, so... I have five do you strike. Happen, do you happen to know what my defense is? Six. Six? Six. Damn. That's pretty good. <laughs> it's a heavily armored tank. That it is. I got two. I got one. Okay, bounced it. Spanged it. Okay. Um, and you gonna do anything else? Nope. Okay, I guess we're just gonna sit here and see whose tank dies first. <laughs> yep. Tank duel to the end. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. Tank moved up. Uh, driver activated on the one. And the commander's gonna fire on the four. And I did move up to get... So we're no longer obscuring each other through the... Um, Scrubland. Scrubland. So... Need the five. It's yep. a hit. You get five and I get three. Five against three. Come on, Char. I got one. one. You got none. So again, one, one net, net hit. hit. <laughs> Same thing again. Same thing again. Uh, shock and can't shock activate. Shock and can't activate gun. next turn. Okay. Uh, well, let's just dive right into it because I got nothing else to do. I'm on Overwatch back there just waiting for this tank thing to resolve itself. <laughs> no three again. Yeah. Uh, two. It's another three fours again. That's the third time you've rolled three fours in this game. Come on, Char. Okay, I got my three. Yeah. Really, I'll oh, and another chain of command points. Yep. Okay. You hit me last time. Yep, Char. So I need a four this time, as Robert said. Yep. Because I hit him last time. Oh, it's a four. Damn. Okay. Damn, good thing of that. One, two, three. Four, four. five. Yep. All right, come on. We're, di we're zoned in here. <laughs> I got nothing. Nothing. But you could roll nothing. I could too. roll nothing. I oh, did not. One. So you bounced it. Bounce it. Bounced it. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. This is a flat fight. I didn't realize your tank had such good uh, AP on it. So you did get the three ones that you can do the tank yep. with. Yep. I'm gonna remove the shock and fire. You I can't. Need... Yeah, I can. It's not the next phase. Oh, that's right. You missed the phase. Okay. So I need a five. Okay. Need a five. Got it. I'm five to your six. I got two. I got two. Okay, equal hits on a four. What is that? Uh, 
halt and engage fire. This is what you want to no do. No problem there. <laughs> okay, we move on. Yep. Same deal. Okay, I'm up to four now. Yep. And you're at five, I believe. Yep. And I got my three. Back to fours again. You got me. Another hit. All right, come on, guys. This little Soviet tank can't withstand this punishment for long. Oh, there we go. Three. Oh, oh dead. Okay. Kaboom. I'll have to see if it blows up first. So, I think on a five or a six. Yep. Five or six, it explodes. Nope. Nope. So it's just a support unit lost, a bad thing. Okay. One. Probably minus one. Yeah, support unit killed, but a one is minus one. Okay. So he's down to seven. Mm -hmm. I'm down to ten. And yeah. Is there anything else I want to do? Let me think about it. Okay, okay. Got rid of that pesky tank that's been killing all my guys. Two threes, a two, a four, and a six. Here we go. Okay, I can move my tank. Yes, you can. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna do. So he still has four support points. Um, so I, I can't just drive over there and start capturing jump off points quite yet because Vehicles, something... I don't think can capture jump off points. Sure they can. They I touch them. I think what? they can. Why wouldn't they? Um, all right, we'll, we'll figure it out. Char now, after killing the Soviet tank, is moving up. Moved up, we're going to have to cross that creek. And we're just going to call it there, so it is uh, your phase, dude. Okay. Change command point. Okay, two ones and a two. He's doing nothing. Got a three. Mm -hmm. So we'll try to cross the creek. Okay. Go crossing the creek. I <laughs> got an inch. Mm -hmm. So I didn't make it. Nope. All right, your face. <laughs> Might as well just bring my command dice over here. Another chain of command point. Go for it. All right. All right, we'll do it again. Come on, get across the damn creek. <laughs> <laughs> nope. It's taking forever to get across this creek. All right. Yes, it is. Uh, your face. <laughs> Come on, guys. Gun the engine, damn it. Another chain of command point. All right. And my go again? Your go again. No three. But I did get two, two fives. There you go. So I have a chain of command dice now. And, yeah, I mean, Kopke will give a little motivational speech and we'll press on. Another chain Another of command chain point. point. You're All up. Right. Give me a three, damn it. Okay, there's a three. Hey, double phase. Double phase. And another chain of command point and a three. Let's get across that creek. Oh, now we get across. Now you get across. Okay, so we're across the creek and we'll mm -hmm. go on to the next phase. Uh, no three. No three. <laughs> okay, so two fives. All right, and then it'll be your phase. Uh, two fours and a one to work with. Uh, another another chain, chain command, command point. What are you up to now? Two full ones? Nope. Almost there. Okay. Almost. You're up. All right. Okay. Hey, there's a three. There's a three. And another chain. I'm caught up to you now. Yeah, you are. All right. Um, okay. We'll just move the tank up, I guess. What the hell? Made it up there. You know, captured that jump off point for now, or until he gets it back. Hey, another five. Yep. Two fours and a three. I think you roll a lot of fours tonight. I have. <laughs> Tons of fours. So. So we'll see what he does. Brought in another squad here. Two and the one made a three. They went on overwatch. And I decided just to leave the tank uh, there on and put it on overwatch. I don't want to get too close to these jump off points right now. Like if I got within four, I could shut it down, but I might not make it. So Soviet face. A couple more fives. Mm-hmm. A bunch of twos. Two, yep. Two twos and a four. Two twos and a four. Standing fast. A three, a two, a four, and another chain of command points. Squad moved out. Ten inch move for these guys. And a no inch move. <laughs> two, a two ones over there. So they're just going to stay in the woods and the tank will just stay on overwatch. Hey, another five. And a one, three, three. Two, three, three. Yep. Two more fives. Damn. Okay. One, three, three. Squad has continued to uh, advance up towards the 
scrub land here, and then that squad rolled again a crappy move, so they're barely out of the woods. Next, next Soviet phase. That's pretty good. A bunch of threes and a two and another five. One, one, three, four. Continue the advance there in the scrub land. This guy's got a 10 inch move this time, so they're getting up here. Soviets. <laughs> three more fives and a three. Damn. Yep. Doing nothing. Oh, what the hell is this crap? One, one, four, five. Okay. Yep. He came out and by himself ordered that squad up. They got another great move, so we got two squads up here in the rush land. Mm -hmm. um, these guys. They didn't, they're not moving. Tank got a six inch move. I got within four of this one, shut it down. I spent a chain of command point to end the turn, which got rid of that one. So you gotta roll a bad no, thing. No, I don't. He's ignoring the bad thing, okay. Ignoring the bad thing. All right, and, okay. Soviet phase, he's down to one jump off point. Mm -hmm. Steady deploy drum. Fives are killing you. Of course, you've had plenty of opportunity to bring stuff in. Uh, one and a two to work with. Yeah, definitely. Oh, no. <laughs> Four. Okay. Two fours, a one. Okay, I'm going to bring... I'm going to bring Lankowski in. Okay. I wish I would have brought him up there, but... It is what it is. I'll move Kopke, and that's pretty much it. I had uh, Jens move up. He got a decent move. And then, he, with his last two commands, he put this squad on Overwatch. And then Lankowski came in. Over there with that squad on the fire base, and that is it. So, Soviet phase. Dog barking. More fives and fours. Oh You're my up. God. Into that corner over there. Gonna close the trap. Four twos. Okay. Kowski, I had him bring uh, the squad out here. What's left of it? Because from where they were, they have no line of sight. There's not really any threat to uh, on this side anymore. So they're coming out. Up towards the scrubland, Jens got up here and put these guys on Overwatch. And next Soviet phase. <laughs> the utter pointlessness continues. You're up. One, two, two, three. Wow. One, one, two, two, three. Made a three. These guys moved up. Got another decent move. Uh, the other three, I had these guys move up and just to the edge. They're not on Overwatch anymore. And then the tank moved up and captured this one now. Your face. Okay, uh, one, one, three, four, six. And two, three, three, four. So I've moved up, um, captured this. I'm gonna spend another chain of command point and end the turn again. I'm going to negate the morale costs. Okay. Which means I can't deploy, but I'm not withdrawing. And my force morale is not below three. Yep. So I win, right? No, I think you lose. How do I lose? I've not been forced from the table. All right, hold on. We'll figure this out. My force morale. So it's over. Um, first platoon has again driven the Soviets. Well, I guess sort of you driven never the Soviets. The Soviets. <laughs> the Soviets never appeared. They were running through the swamps back to uh, table five. So. Uh, we'll come. We'll figure out the, at the sharp end stuff. We'll come back and then we'll wrap it up. Okay, so we're back to wrap it up. Um, as far as first platoon, uh, the CO's opinion went up one. He's now at uh, plus. What the hell was I at? You're at plus, plus four. Now. Plus four. Plus four. CO's opinion. Plus five. Men's opinion. We lost nobody. One man will uh, be wounded for the next game. That's it. Just due to the force morale difference. Um, and. Jens himself went from happy to secure, which is just a move to the right, didn't make any difference. Meanwhile, the Soviets are at minus three on the men's opinion now. They've actually gone up two because they didn't lose anyone in the game. And then minus three on their force on their CO's opinion, though, sadly, which is going to be minus one on his force support. And then his thought or his own opinion, the Soviet leader's opinion, is now retiring, which is going to give minus one on his force morale roll. So next game, he's going to be minus one on force morale, men's opinion, and support. And I'm going to be plus one on I think I'm actually going to be minus two on force morale. Possibly. Okay. So yeah, uh, that was a weird, weird game. <laughs> it started off really good for Robert with that tank killing. Took out five dudes and wounded a leader. But I got most of those back due to force morale difference. Mm -hmm. 
Um, I would have got them all back if you didn't burn some of those chain of command dice to oh, stop did. those yeah. uh, enforcement yeah, I did. So uh, let's talk about our plans real quick. So my plan was to get in here and bring the tank out and start shelling. Um, try to get you to come out and fight, fight me, but you never did. And that's pretty much my whole plan. So, so again, I guess it worked. You saw my plan. The tank came out, got some initial casualties, and then... The usual thing happened. I had several phases where I couldn't do anything. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And three then, or four phases where we were in almost all fours. And then, I mean, there were opportunities where you had, like, these guys alone up in the scrub. Mm hmm. Yeah. And then I would have enough to deploy one squad. That's just suicide. Yeah. So he had a good plan. Don't bring anything out piecemeal. That's a very important lesson to learn in Chain of Command. Um, but. It, uh, that I mean, a lot that by do I mean not I'm not saying that's not a good idea because if you would have brought one squad out it would have just been a bad thing. I had one. I think I had <laughs> one opportunity to bring out three squads, and you had all your guys in mutual support on Overwatch. Yeah, and it's tough. It would have been okay. The one good fusillade, and then I take all the incoming fire on Overwatch. Right, and even in entrenchments because I bought enough entrenchments for all of them. Oh, you did. Yeah. Oh, shit, yeah. I, I mean, I had... So I had three entrenchments, the two oh, Molotov yeah. cocktails, and a tank. Okay. Well, it didn't work out for you this time. So uh, first platoon has uh, swept... <laughs> they swept through Yartsevo, they swept through Zarborie, and yeah. the Soviets are pinned back at their home table. Yep. And if I take that, then he's just going to be attacking back into his home table. Yep. So, yeah. Um, but anyway, yeah, it's a very short game this night, tonight. Weird game, not a very good game. I'll just come out and say it outright. So what we're going to do, just for fun, is we're going to switch sides. I'm going to take the Soviets with the same amount of support points he had. He's going to take the Germans with the same amount of support points I had. And I'll see if I can do any better. So we'll go ahead and set that up. Oh, and we'll just use the same jump off points and everything. Uh, that way we don't have to go through I all that. I don't know. Remember where my jump up points were? Oh uh, yeah, there was one here, one here, and one here. Okay. All right, so we'll, we'll go and we'll see what I can do if I can do any better. All right, so a quick correction before we start this game. Um, I did lose two guys. Force morale difference was one, one less than we thought it was. So I did lose a German soldier and then one re to return next game after. So he has killed one German in three games. Um, so congratulations to the Soviets there. So what we're doing now, we're gonna reset. Uh, we're gonna pick. New support, we're gonna use all the same force morale, same jump off points and everything. So I had eight points. So what I'm gonna bring is four entrenchments, one for each squad. And I'm also bringing a 45 millimeter AT gun in, in an entrenchment as well. Uh, that's because I, th I think he's probably gonna bring a tank. I don't know. Um, but if he does, I wanna have something at least to give it something to think about. So I'm gonna to try to pack in as close as I can together here um, and sit in my entrenchments and see if he'll come get me. I mean, that's really the only the only option the Soviets have on this board is to, the way that the jump off points are, is to just dig in and say, come get us, bro. <laughs> so with that being said, that's what I'm going to do. And that's my plan. And I got jump off points here, there, and there, honestly. We're going to deploy off that one, push up to the woods, set up the base of fire there, while we're pushing up to that woods, we're going to set up here. I took support on an infantry gun, a pack 36. So I've got a good 10 HE and about 10 AP should a tank come. And this is the only tank ground. So deploy them in a squad here, push two squads up to here. They will then go on overwatch while we push the rest of the force up for the main assault. So... We will see how bad my command rolls are. All right, that's the plans. That's the plans. Let's so. see how bad the command rolls are. Let's get rid of these while we're at it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, pretty bad. Three and a one, but three fives. So. Yep. Let's see. All right, well, you brought uh, all of the support in, which I was not expecting to not see a tank. Let's just say that. Mm -hmm. But he's brought a Pack 36 AT gun mm -hmm. and the uh, light howitzer in there so we got two teams over mm -hmm. there and on to the soviet phase on to the soviet phase here we go there's six right there yeah the super soviets hey end of turn end of turn 
<laughs> end of turn, end of turn double phase. I wish you would have brought that pregame barrage now. Uh, a one and a four. One yeah. and a four. Forget it. I'm moving on. Okay. Not good. Again. Three, four, four. You can bring a tank on. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a tank. Yeah. Uh, okay. Shit. Yeah, that's not a very good roll, but we'll see. What, we'll, we'll think about it. Sadly, I'm not going to do anything. Wasted double phase. Welcome to my world. And we got two, 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 three. Mm hmm. I was another squad here, so they're packed in tight for my 81 millimeter mortar barrage. But you don't have it. <laughs> uh, and then he put another squad in the house. So there's one machine gun looking out the front door on Overwatch. Mm -hmm. So everything's on Overwatch now because he brought himself in. He's made himself the leader. Yeah. The guy there with the uh, Nazi looking guy with the long black leather coat. And well, that's it. Uh, you're, you're, uh, I, I hate to break to you, your squad is out of clean pants. So. <laughs> Uh, we don't need clean pants in the Soviet in Soviet Russia. Well, you do, but uh, okay, that's not horrible. One, can... two, three, four, five. Yep. Hey, Yahtzee. Okay, I brought some stuff in. Uh, in entrenchments, two squads, plus the leader, and we are safely hidden behind the shrub land here. Okay. In German phase. End of turn. Another end of double turn. phase. And a one. And a one. You can bring your mortar in. I could. Might as well. Got his motor in there behind the woods. And everyone's off Overwatch. End of turn. Another double phase. Double phase. I forgot to drop one. But I forgot to drop one. Everyone's back on Overwatch. Everyone's back on Overwatch. All right, now drop one. Now oh. drop one. <laughs> double phase. <laughs> drop another one. <laughs> Okay, that's three double phases in a row, and we've seen the mortar activate. No, we've seen <laughs> oh. it show up. Oh, yeah, and then everyone went on Overwatch. All right, two twos two and a twos one. Two twos and a one. These guys are played on Overwatch. These right guys now. came out of the house, got a damn good 12-inch move out of the house. So they're heading up to the scrublands. So heading up to the scrublands. Yeah, we'll see if they can do anything once they get there. Soviet phase. Ah, three more fives, perfect. <laughs> and, and that's it, your phase. Okay. Oh, that's Ooh, a good roll. Yeah. That's a really good roll. Oh, All I'm right. going to bring in my senior leader. Okay. These two squads have moved out, and these guys ran. He pulled one of the shock off of this junior leader, and Soviet phase. Double phase, and another five, and a one and a two. Uh, yeah, forget it. We move on. Double phase and <laughs> <laughs> nothing. Okay, uh, we move on. Keep moving. Nothing. All right, your go. One a double, double phase. phase. <laughs> the one, all I need. One and a two. Both squads just continue their advance towards the scrub. Next phase. One, two, three, five. <laughs> These guys have advanced up right to the edge. We're ordered not to go into the scrub. Those guys got a hell of a move all the way over here, took a couple shock, but uh, they're almost caught up with those guys now. So mm -hmm. I think that'll do it. So next phase. Next. Hey, a couple more fives. Mm-hmm. And a one, three, four. Brought in my last squad. I did have the adjutant. That's why I was able to do that uh, without the with the leader already on. I also brought in the mortar mm -hmm. so we're gonna fire we just have line of sight to that uh, eight uh the howitzer so the this squad and the howitzer can see each other okay. um, and i'm gonna fire at the howitzer even fives mm -hmm. one two two whole hits so one hit on the howitzer one hit on the uh pack oh one dead on the howitzer one dead on the pack <laughs> Does not get the leader. Okay. Uh, and then the mortar, eight and fives. Yep. Nothing. Okay. I uh, killed the guy out of each crew. Yeah, you annoyed them. So I got six HE back at you. Technically, I don't even know if you could have split those because I can't see the pack. So technically, you can't. I think you still split to it. You, you're, you're firing in the general direction. I mean, we. Um, okay. Right back with his Overwatch. One. One hit. 
Light Reducing cover. cover. Point shock. of shock. No waste. All right. Okay. Um. Yeah, you're go. My day. Yeah, it's been rough. So yeah, it was two guys killed out of the howitzer. Triple phase. End of phase. End of turn again. Five and a two. Uh, yeah, that's crap. Okay. Yeah. A wasted double phase. I guess all our overwatches go away, though. Yeah. Your overwatches are gone. Okay. Alright. Three, three, five, and a two. I think he's out of sight. He's just moved uh, both guns over a little bit. He's out of sight now with my squad over here. And these guys moved up. Double phase and a bunch of threes. Mm-hmm. Which I'm not doing shit with. Well, hold on. Maybe I will. Brought in my gun. Uh, HE4, apparently, on this AT gun, which is pretty good for mm -hmm. a small AT gun. And then I put him on Overwatch. I put this squad on Overwatch. Now I wish I would have maybe had a chance to put something on Overwatch last phase, but I just blew through. <laughs> Another double phase and a one and a three. Mm -hmm. He's just had everyone move out. We're moving out. I'm going to try to get up and reestablish that in the scrub land, the whole thing. Uh, what do you got? One, two, One, two three, four. four. Yeah, everything is moved right. up. Everything is moved. Yeah, everything is moved. Uh, Kopke, who was behind the house, mm -hmm. is now out here. Um, he could pull two shock. He used one to move. Okay, he's pulling two shock then. All right, he's pulled the shock off these guys, and then this guy Clever here. Hans. Clever Hans has moved everything up. So right now, it's uh, the interesting thing is going to be how does he get in here? Mm-hmm. A double phase has been coming pretty damn con uh, consistently, so yep. a double phase would be the way to do it, mm -hmm. um, preferably after the turn ended. Preferably. Uh, so it's, we'll see. So we'll it's see. Soviet phase. Okay. Yeah, I'm doing nothing. I got nothing left to bring in. I'm just waiting now. I'm just going to wait. I mean, I have nothing left to do. Another double, double, double phase. And two fours. That's really all I need. Oh, my God. These double phases are just unbelievable. These guys have moved around there, and then all this stuff has just moved up again. Running out of uh, scrub land there to line up on. Whoa. <laughs> a bunch of fives and a three. With that three, you just move the pack up, so... It's getting pretty crowded there. Getting They're pretty lining crowded up there. behind the, the, the hedge or the, uh, whatever the hell that's called, scrub land. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. Oh, and I did put the rest of these guys on Overwatch with that last roll, too. So, you got your go. Double phase. <laughs> nope. Got a couple more fives, two fours, and a one. That's all I needed. The advance continues. Uh, the pack is now up there with the rest of the guys. And next We heard there was a door we wanted to knock. <laughs> Plenty of doors over here. Double phase. Double phase. Yay. Give me some fives, damn it. There's there two we fives. go. I'll take the two fives and everything's on Overwatch, so yep. I'm done. He ended the turn. So all my Overwatches are gone. Is this where you start moving into the shrub land? Yes, it is. Okay. All so he's going to have uh, Popkey. Cocky order this squad to move up 1d6. He's mm -hmm. got into the shrubs. Into the shrubs. And we're going to fire on those Soviets. Uh, who are you firing at? I'm firing at that squad on the end. Okay. I get nine dice, I need fives. Yep. So we're over something. Over 18. Three hits. Three hits. All right, one on the mortar, who's in the open. Uh, one on the other squad, and then one on the other squad. You got really <laughs> wow. lucky there. That's some good hard cover. That's from those holes you were digging. Clearly. All right, um, so next then squad will do the same the, thing. Well, no, the gun's going to move up. Okay. The pack moved up into the shrub land. And he's gonna have the mortar fire. Mm-hmm. So needing fives. Needing fives. Two, Two hits. hits. All right. This squad here. And the other squad. Two shock. Two shock. Or one shock each. One shock each. Okay. And then Hans is gonna have this squad do the same thing. Move up one d6 and fire. Uh, hold on here. I might want to use my dice to interrupt and fire at you before okay. you get another squad in there. Yeah, I'll do that. What the hell? Okay. Interrupt. I'm going to have this squad fire at uh, the gun. Okay. All right. So need fives. Yep. Shit, I was way the hell over there. Three. Uh, one, two, three, Jesus. four, five. 
Damn, holy crap. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hits. Okay, so four on the gun and four go. Actually, I can spread them across all three squads. All uh, three teams. Yeah, they're within four. Teams. So three on the gun, three on one. You had eight hits. Yeah. So two have to go on the gun because the men are in worse cover. Okay. So the gun is in heavy cover. One dead. Dead. Okay. We'll have to keep track of that. The next team. Next team. Uh, two points of shock. Two points of shock. And the next team. Two points, two points of, shock. of shock. All right. So roll for your leader. Why? You can't. You have a junior leader in that, in yeah, that gun crew. I, you have to kill two for me to roll under it, don't you? No. No, no. You just have to roll equal two. Oh, it is him. <laughs> he takes a wound, so uh, bad thing. Two. Minus two. Yeah. It's going to take him down to eight, nine. nine. Yeah. And he's got a wounded leader on the gun crew. Squad has moved up, and they're going to take a shot at the gun on the end there. Even fives. Three. All right, so we'll do uh, two on the gun. No, one on the gun, two on the squad, because the squad's in worse cover. No, they're all in hard cover. But your gun shield would... You're right, they're all in hard cover, so yeah. yeah. It's all the same. Two on the gun, then. Two on the gun. One shot. Nothing. No, nothing. You're right, in you The squad. Nothing. nothing. Okay, what else you got? Still going here? Same thing. Yeah, they're only going to move up an inch. They're not going to make gonna it. They're not going to be able to make it. Okay, so he's got a lot and of And then the gun. Actually, he's going to move an inch this way. Okay, then the gun will move up. And the then it'll be Soviet phase. All right, so the gun's up there. Soviet phase. Yeah. And you better pray I don't roll a double phase here. <laughs> it would not surprise me the way this yeah. campaign has been treating me. It wouldn't surprise me very much either, to tell you the truth. No double phase. But I do have a lot of, uh, a pretty decent roll here. One, two, three, one, four. All right, I've, I've got enough to fire everything and pull the shock. So we're going to fire everything and we pulled the shock. Starting with the mortar, um, we'll fire at uh, the gun here, I guess. Okay. Nothing. Not a damn thing. Okay, the squad. Mm-hmm. Squad will fire needing fives. Firing at? Oh, uh, we're just going to start over here on okay. the gun. Okay. Or the gun. The gun? Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six hits. Okay, so I can put one, one. All right, so, uh, yeah, he's split yeah. them. Okay. Light cover. Nothing. Not it. Okay. Two here. Nada. All right. Hard cover for the gun. Nothing. Okay. This squad here. Point of sh nothing. no, nothing because they're in light cover. And this squad here. Point of One shock. point of shock. One point of shock. All right. Next, next volley, man. One. Only two that time. Who are you firing at? I'll fire at the squad on the end this time. Okay, one on this squad, the team there. It's a shock. And the middle team, nothing. Okay, next volley. Okay. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hits that time. Firing at. And the squad on the end here. Okay, so three on the three on them, three on them, and three on the gun. Okay. So three on the gun. Point of shock. Point of shock. I got it. Okay. The middle. One, two, three shock. So they're at five. Yep. And this last one. One dead. Alright. It's not the junior leader. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. With nine shock. Oh boy. Almost pinned them. Almost. Okay, so that was uh, all three. So yep. the last thing I have is my AT gun. Yep, four HE shots. Which is going to fire at uh, these guys down here again. Okay. Um, yep, yep, four. Four <sighs> hits. So, okay. Um, one on the gun. Two on the middle team. One on the outside team. Nothing. Two, two shock. shock. They're, I think they're pinned. They're at seven. And a casualty on the gun. Not the leader. Not the leader. 
So another gun casualty? No, that's the leader. Oh. Yeah, okay. another gun casualty. All right, so you got, now I think these guys are definitely pinned. Yeah. Okay, so we pinned a squad, but he still has a lot of shit over here. <laughs> Why can't I roll like that when I'm playing the Soviets? I didn't bring anyone out. <laughs> all right, well, I, I, I've brought lots of them out. You can look at all the other tables that I've lost. Oh, yeah. They're all dead. My Soviets are more motivated. I have a scarier uh, commissar. <laughs> Two, two, four, three. Well, the first thing he did, uh, pulled some shots here, and he's gonna cop. He's gonna have them fire. Uh, they get seven shots, mm -hmm. being pinned and all that and all that stuff. So even fives. Yeah, and they're gonna fire at the gun. Okay. Two hits. Okay, one on the gun. The red will be the gun. The white will be the squad. I'm point a shot on the squad. Okay. Uh, so the gun. Force. Okay. His gun to my gun. Two hits. Okay. All uh, right. Uh, red will be the gun. Yep. Uh, it's a point of shock. Point of shock on the squad. I think with the gun shield, I'm still in hard cover. Yeah, I think you are. So it's just another point of shock on the squad. Okay. And then two more. Order at the gun. In fives. Nothing. Nothing. Ding, ding. So now with my second four. They're gonna fire at full effect. That's 19 dice, they're firing at the gun. Okay. This squad uh, on the end, or this no, I'm squad. sorry, this squad firing at, at the gun here. With 19 shots. Mm-hmm. Eight and fives. Two. Just a straight up fire fight here. Four, five. Okay, I'll put Six. There. So okay. three on the gun. Okay, three on the gun. Yep. So the gun's in hard cover. Uh, yep. Point of shock. Point of shock. I rolled four dice for some reason. Point, Point of shock. shock. <laughs> I even rolled an extra dice for you. Mm-hmm. Okay, I've got six inches. Nine, I'm picking on the gun. This, uh, the gun has moved up, and then he moved this squad up a d6 into the shrubs. Then he will fire it off of that. One. One hit on the gun. So Another point, point of shock. shock. Oh man, jump to two shock on the gun now. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think that's it, right? <laughs> uh, I think that's it. All right. Um, so Soviet phase. Yep. Uh, two, two, three, four. I've had the uh, gun crew junior leader pull the shock, so they're down to one. I've had the senior leader pull two shock off of this squad and he's going to have them fire and with the two twos i'm going to have these other two squads fire so everything's going to fire except for the mortar okay and we're going to start over here on the end again okay Let's see if we can break these boys so uh the guys here 14. one two three four five six man these guys are some good shooting russians okay so two on the pack two on this Team and two on the team on the end. One dead. One dead. And hang on, one dead. Nothing. Mm -hmm. The pack. Ooh, we're dead in, dead the, shock in the shock. In the pack. Okay. So uh, check this leader. Yep. No. This leader. No. So a dead out of here. Yep. A dead out of the gun crew, which looks like you don't have any left, so let's put a little... I don't uh, think I've lost that many of the, out of the gun crew. No, I, I, I guess killed one have. last turn. Okay. Okay. Um, so these guys now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight and nine. With nine. So they're still pinned. They're still pinned. Well, they're going to be pinned until the turn ends. Yeah, so the next, the next squad blasting away here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. seven. Good God. Okay. This has a. Silly is a. Uh, three and two on the pack again. The pack. One Whoa. more dead. Another dead on the pack. A point of shock. On this. Yep. Middle group here. Okay, they're up to six. And then two more two points more on of the, shock. Yeah, so they're at 12 on. And the pack. Another 
snuffy, so I'm down to one guy on the pack. Damn. Okay, so we got 12, 12 uh, shock here, mm -hmm. and he lost another guy on the pack. So he's down to two, two gun crew and the leader on the pack. Mm -hmm. So the last squad salvo. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, two on the pack. Damn. Another, another dead on the pack. Jesus. That's something. Two on the middle. Nothing. Two on the end. Nothing. And the pack is not the leader, but I'm down to... One guy in the leader. One guy in the leader. Okay. Um, <sighs> all right, the, uh, the AT gun will now fire. At the squad on the end. One. One hit. Point of shock. Point of shock. Okay, well, I think that's it for me. So your phase. Double phase. Oh, that's what you needed. You needed a break like that. Mm hmm It's the only way you're going to have a chance against my line. But that'll help. That'll yeah. definitely help. So Hans is going to activate these three squats. Yep. Firing with the gun first. Five hits. Five hits. Where are you shooting at? Your... My gun? Your gun. Okay, so we'll do uh, three on the gun. Yep. Still in hardcover. Mm-hmm. Nothing. Whipped. And then two onto the squad next to them. The bullet sponge. Whipped. Nothing there. Okay. 19 dice at the gun. Now the big salvos come. That's You're negative. Not. You're going to roll lots of ones. Negative thinking. It's... <laughs> Every game in the campaign has gone that way. Yeah. That's true. It has. Not too bad. Seven. That's not even half. One, two, three, four. Yeah, but you're needing five. That's pretty good. Five. All right, so we'll do uh, four on the gun. Okay. And three on the squad. Oh, I, guess you, I guess you could put four on the squad if you want, since they're going to be in the... Oh, yeah, no, put no. four on the squad, because they're in the worst cover. Well, technically, they're... One this shot is regular, and one dead. Regular shooting here, not there's no HE here, is it? Well, um, you're yeah, you're right. So it's just a dead guy, okay? Dead guy, yeah, just a dead guy. And then the gun, point of shot. Point of shot. Okay, check the leader. No. Nope. Yeah. And the next nineteen. Next volley. Mm-hmm. That's pretty good. Ten hits. That time, that's a good good volley there. Uh, so dead on the gun. Dead on the gun. Okay. The squad. Point of shock. shock. And the gun leader. No. Okay. Pin squad firing. Still, still at six shots somehow. <laughs> Two. Two hits on the gun. All right. So one on the gun, one on the squad. Gonna be red. Yeah, Nothing. I don't care. Okay, but you did get a double phase. Double phase time. That's pretty good. A bunch of threes and a one, so you can pretty much do everything. Mm -hmm. All right, so you got another uh, full volley on us here. Okay, so he pulled two shock with the three, and then Hans is going to have a bunch of stuff fire. First he had the gun fire, he got uh, two hits. Assuming got my gun again? Yep. Red. Ah, dead, dead guy in the gun. Not the leader. Not the leader. So the gun's down two guys now. Yep. And they have two shock, so they could be pinned out. And then Hans has two more commands, so I guess yep. both of these squads nope. are going to... Um, the pack is going to fire at your gun for four HE. Okay. So Three hits. Okay, so we'll do uh, two on the... Um, that squad? Yep. Uh, it's point of shock. Two. Point of shock. And, okay. And then... Okay, you got one thing left. No, I've still got... Oh, you got uh, Hans is still going here. Hans, yeah, so Hans is going to have them fire full effect 19 dice at your gun. Okay. Well, that's not terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. What is it? Um, three, seven. Okay. So uh, four on the gun. 
Okay. Or we'll do four on the squad. Point One shot. shock. The gun. Oh, another dead. Dead and shock. another shock. It's not the leader. Not the leader. The gun is starting to get peppered. Peppered a bit. Got three shock with three dudes. One more, and one more the shock, and they're going to be three. Good. The middle squad's going to fire. Okay. So two. Nineteen shots from the squad. Yep. Let's see if you can take out the gun. That's the hope. Nine hits. Uh, the squad. De oh. Dead and three shock. Finally, starting to punch through a little bit. The gun. Oh damn! Dead another shock. dead. <laughs> this gun is. Check your leader. Up. Nope, and the leader on the squad. Nope. Okay, so that's, but I think the gun is pinned. They're definitely going to be pinned. Uh, so we have four shock with. Oh, they're going to break. Oh. Yeah. So uh, they'll be off the board. Yep. So it's going to be a bad thing happens. Oh, that's got to be a minus two. Well, because it's junior leader routes and support you routes. Yeah. So that's the first bad thing. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Two. So I'm down to three all of a sudden? Damn. Oh, you were at eight, so you should be at four. Okay. And that's all it takes. Is, all you gotta do is just break a leader like that. Yeah. Okay. Um, now you're done, right? Now I'm done. Okay, Soviet phase. Now I need a double phase, damn it. You yeah, got I got it. one. One, two, four. Okay, so I've made a three with the one and the two. Wait, I pulled two shock. Forgetting to do? Oh, no. My pin squad's in heavy cover. Oh, that's right, huh? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. Well, we'll remember that for next time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because um, they're going to take more fire. He pulled uh, two shock, this junior leader here. With the four, I'm going to have this squad leader pull another shock. So they're down to three shock now. Okay. And then I'm going to have the junior leader have these two squads fire. Okay. And I think we'll start working on uh, these guys on this end over here now. These guys? Yep. Okay. So one, two, three, four hits. Okay. So two on the, the team with five, one there and one on that gun. Okay. These two don't okay. care. This one doesn't care. The gun doesn't care. Okay, the next spot, next salvo. One, two, three, four hits. Same distribution. Gun, doesn't care. These guys, point of shock. This guy in the end, does point, of, a shock. point of shock. Okay. That's that. Uh, next phase. Two, three, four, four. Did you have it? I've uh, got these guys down to one shock, and then everyone's going to fire. Um, and, and even the mortar. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Here we go. Oops, needing fives, so we'll start with the squad on the end there. One, two, three, four, five hits there. Okay, so two on the end team. Point of shock. Point of shock. Get some shock on these boys. Some kills, shock. The middle. Two points shock. Of shock. There we go. Starting to build up. Okay, and then the gun. Ooh, Dead. and these, gun, these guns are taking a lot of kills, man. Not the leader. But so you're down to... Two guys on the gun, two. plus the leader. Okay, so the next salvo. Yep. One, two, three, four hits. Okay, so two on the middle. Point of shock. Point of shock. That was the second salvo. One there, nothing. One on the gun. Point of shot. No, no nothing there in hard cover. Um, so, okay, so I'll drop one for that last squad there. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Six hits this two, time. Two each. Two, two shots. Nothing. And the gun. Dead in a point of shock. It is not the leader. So. Are you down to one guy now? One guy and the leader. Okay, so you have one guy left, all right? Uh, I think that's it. Oh, and the mortar. Uh, the mortar will fire at them, too. Okay. 
two hits. So team, one per team, I guess. Yep. In the open. Shock. The shock. shock. Oh boy. Okay. We'll count so up the got shock. got ten shock. Ten shock. And ten guys. Oh damn. So they're not key. pinned. Okay, so that squad is one away from being pinned. If you get a double phase here though, you might have some hope. I nope, did not. He did not. So one, one, three, three, something. Yeah. Start with that uh, team on the end there. They're down to 15 shots. Three, five, six. So three each. Okay. So the uh, white one will be the squad on the uh, left. Mm hmm. Nothing. <sighs> Hard cover. Six dice into them. Four hits. Okay. White will be the yeah, squad on the left. Soft cover. This in the gun, right? Yep. Oh, the two squad on the right dead. takes two dead. Not the leader. Okay. Nineteen into that squad on the end. Okay. It's a hell of a roll, though. Uh, I wouldn't say that. It's pretty damn good. Four. It'll be the squad on the uh, right. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Again, hard cover. Didn't save me the last time, but... Uh, Four out of the gun, out of the pack, into that end squad. Two hits, so one each. Okay. Here on light cover this time. Point uh, of shock. Point of shock. Okay. So I pulled some shock here, he's going to fire them order. One hit on the end squad. End squad. Oh, Dead no. It's a good mortar. It's the leader. <laughs> oh, God. Minus one. So I'm down to three. Yep. I got down there quick. That means I'm going to lose the dice. Yep. Okay. Is that it? Uh, yes. Okay. Probably. Two fours. And a five. <laughs> and a five. All right, so, uh, well, with one four, I'll have everyone fire again. I'm going to interrupt. Okay. I'm going to pump six HE shots into the end squad. All right. Two hits. Okay, squad on the left is, uh, wait. Uh, point of shock. Point of shock. So much a two shock. I'm really not bad off. My force morale is bad, down to three. But yeah. really, I've only lost the gun in like three guys. Yep. It's just that when you start at eight and you lose four, you're, uh, yep. <laughs> you're, not, you're in bad shape. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's, uh, now I will fire everything. Yep. I'm gonna get these guys on the end. Okay. Or should I try to get these guys over? Are they at eight with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? Okay, mm -hmm. she's been pulling shock, so I'm not gonna break them. We'll just fire at those guys on the end there, see if okay. we can pin them at least. One, two, three, four, five, six hits. It's pretty good. Yep. Okay, two on the gun. Stupid gun. Point of shock. So they're up to two shock, huh? Up to two shock on two guys. Ah, so they can break next. Yeah. <laughs> Middle squad. Ooh. One dead and a point of shock. That's bad. Yep. Was there any left? Just one? Uh, two more, because you had six hits. Okay. Uh, one Ooh. dead on the end squad. And did I get the leader? Nope. No. So two dead. All right. So these guys are pinned now. So hard cover. We'll have to remember that. These guys probably lost quite a few guys or got a lot of shock for not remembering that rule. Um, next salvo, I took a few off for casualties. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. The best shooting Soviet squad of all time. Really good. Two each. Yep. Nothing. Nothing. And the gun. Nothing. Wow. All right. Skate in on that one. The last one. One. Two, three. Three hits. One each. That squad. Nothing. The middle team. Nothing. The gun. Point of, Point shock. of shock. The gun is now pinned. Yep. Two guys with three shock. Two guys with three shock. Damn, and all I needed was two freaking shock and they would have broke. 
Damn it. And that's it for me. So it's your go. I'm hanging by a thread. You are. Double, Double phase. phase. And I can't do me. shit. Uh, yeah, you can. You got a two and a one. You could fire yeah. something. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna interrupt. And okay. I'm gonna see if I can get that gun to break. Fire away. So back onto these guys on the end here. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six hits. End team. I'm getting so lucky. Middle with team. Nothing. Gun. Point of shot. You broke them. They're gonna break. Yeah. But I had to use my chain of command dice I was gonna end the turn with. So it's not gonna be nearly as devastating force morale wise as I was hoping. Uh, so they're gonna fall back 2d6 plus 6 and okay. to roll a bad thing. Oh, they're gonna be way the hell back there. Uh, so you just dropped one on his force morale after all that. I had to do it though. Especially since I saw that double phase. At least that saves me from getting all those HE shots. Over what HE shots? Well, whatever would have came out of the gun. Nothing. In the squad. In the That's not super good. Five. Five? That's not horrible. Alright then. Uh, same deal. Yep. Red will be the right squad. Oh, damn. Two dead and two shock. Yeah. So a dead uh, each and a shock. And two shots at leaders. Okay. No leaders. No leaders. So but it's a dead guy per. Yep. And a shock, shock each. Shock per. Okay. I mean, really, I'm not doing horrible. I've lost maybe five dudes, and I'm up to five total shock between the two squads. Yeah. All right, next phase. What? Oh, my Three God. Three and a one, and a point of chain of command. Starting with this full squad, 19 shots. And then he's going to have the gunfire, and one of the pin squads are going to fire up to that. Yep. Four. Here we go. Uh, point of uh, shock. Point of shock. God, that was, uh, I got damn lucky on that one. Okay, and then you got the uh, 4 HE from four the gun. 4 Two, so one each were a waste. Oh, yeah. Two dead. Not quite a waste. Oh, just two dead. So we're whittling. We're whittling. And then the remaining six are going into that light mortar in the open. Okay. Two. Light mortar in the open. He's dodged every bullet so far. Except one dead. One dead. Oh, and a shock. Yep. Okay, so dead and a shock. Yep. Check the leader. Nope, not There is no there. leader on the mortar team. Yeah, but my my big man's oh, uh, yeah. within four of them. Um, okay, and that's it, right? That's it. Okay, what do I need? I don't even know what I want here. <laughs> well, you got that'll work. That, yeah, that'll yeah. work per perfectly. I was able to combine, pull enough shock to get both squads down to one shock each. And then these guys are going to be down to 11 shots each. And then the squad on the end is still full, full strength. And everything's going on to this middle squad now, since they're not in any kind of cover. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Look at that. Eight hits. Yep. Eight sixes. So two on the gun, because it's in hard cover. Two they shock, broke. they broke. They might. Uh, no, I think they're pinned. Three shock with, yeah, three, three shock with two guys. Yeah, they're pinned. Yeah, so you need uh, one more to break. Nothing. Nothing there. Okay. And the next three. Nothing. Okay. Um, so the next volley will go into that squad as well. Yep. One, two, two three. Three hits. Okay, only two time. hits on the team of five. One, two shock. One shock, so three shock total. The 14, uh, I'm going to target uh, the gun. Okay. One, two, three, four, five that time. Okay, so one on the gun. One on that squad, one on that squad, team, one on this team, and one on this team. Because they're all within four. Alright. Nothing? 
Nothing. The gun, which is in super hard cover. <laughs> Dead. Dead. It's not the leader. But the gun breaks. Break. They will break. <sighs> of course uh, they will. Four. What shock. Nothing. So a point of shock on these guys, yes. and then the gun will break. It happens for the gun breaking. Well, only they roll one dice, but... Uh, well, it's 2D, no, it's 2D6 oh, it's and back. 6. Okay, yeah. So they go back 12. Yep. And then, uh, now a bad thing. Man, I wish I could end the turn. That's probably minus 1. I think so. Yeah, if that's what you rolled last time. So you're only down to, wait, 7? Seven? 7. Wow, okay. Uh, this is getting close, man. It's getting close. It shouldn't. I, yeah. Okay, uh, next phase. Uh, let's see here, he's got a one, two, three, five, and a six. So he's gonna have this squad leader pull the shock and he's gonna have a, he's gonna fire. His last full strength squad. I think it's bad. six. Yeah, six. 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 Three and three and you're in hard cover. Okay. Come on, hardcover. <laughs> oh man, again two dead. Two dead and two shock. Alright. Shock each and no leader though. But another dead. Luckily I took all that shock. So they're up to two shock again. And six more into that light mortar in the open. And another two dead. Six more, alright? Light mortar in the open. Two. Two, two hits. Uh, shock. Yeah, they're gonna break. So they're off the board for twelve. Yeah. So team Rabbit. routes. It's gotta be a minus two. I think. Uh, team. Oh no, they just broke. What I roll? Well, they routed because they routed out the board. Yeah, but they don't route. Um, you roll the four on team Brown. Minus one. Okay, so you're down to two. Down to two. Oh so I'll give God. you what? You lose jump off points. And you're down to three dice. Okay. Down to three dice. Which jump off point? Not that it matters. Hardly matters. That one. <laughs> okay. All right. Mm -hmm. And it'll be my phase. Yeah, a five. Just what I wanted. A one and a two. <laughs> yep. So you can activate a team or a squad. Uh, yeah, my mortar's gone. Yep. So, uh, yeah, I'll just fire a squad. So firing at these guys with the full squad. Three, four. One, two, yeah. Four hits. So two on this one. Nothing. Nothing. Two on that one. Two a, points. Two shock. shock. So they're up to four. And not good enough. All right, your phase. Yep. All right. Well, I mean, we can't do anything else at this point. So no, this we just have to endure. Firefight. My uh, oh, horse morale is going to break. Yeah. Me. I really. Well, I lost the gun and I lost the mortar. But I still have. Pretty intact squads. So two chain command points yeah. and one three one three four. four. Shocky moved up, pulled two shock, and they're gonna fire. The pin squad's gonna fire. Two hits. Okay, one each. As usual. Nothing. Okay. So that's uh, cocky. That's a four, and you have a one and a three left. I'm gonna add them. So Hans is gonna activate. Okay. He's gonna have. This squad fire, this squad fire, and the mortar fire. Okay. Mortar all on that end squad. So the mortar needs fives. Nope. Oh, nothing there. All right. I got eight, 16, 18, 19, down four. Down two. Down two. So that's 17. Okay. Full salvo. Six. Okay. Six hits. Come on, hardcover. <laughs> uh, no. Some shock. Two shock and then one shock. Okay, so uh, two shock on these guys. They're at four shock with one, two, three, four, six guys. Yep. And then a shock on these guys. Yep. They're at three now. Okay, and then and that's then what on the end. Yep. Eight, 16, 17. Minus four is 13, half to six. Okay. Two hits. Two hits. Coming right up. 
Nothing. Nothing that time. Okay. That's it. Yeah, I think I'll just call it. Um, yeah. It's getting late here, and I mean, it would be interesting to see where this went if we just kept doing this long-range firefight, but uh, I have a feeling eventually I'm going to get a leader hit or something's going to happen, so we'll come back and wrap it up. All right, so yeah, it was an interesting game. Um, I think you did a pretty good job getting in here by ending the turn that time yeah. and then getting in. Um, and then my... I probably would have tried to wait for a double phase to do that, but it worked out okay. Yeah. Um, and then you just you rolled very well. On I the rolled shooting. super good on the shooting. These Soviets are they've been at the range. They've been putting in a lot of range time. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, you had two squads pinned, two guns broken. Yep. And you were down to seven on your force morale. Yep. I honestly probably should have dropped one of the guns and taken a mortar battery. Yeah, mortar would have been yeah. pretty good. <laughs> but uh, yeah, if I just had a dice to end the turn. You would have mm -hmm. had two-liter routes. That's what killed me. Yeah. My gun routing dropped me four force morale in one uh, one swift stroke, and that and starting at eight, I mean, I was already down to four. I was already down to four by then. Yeah, that was no, that I mean, was pretty rough. Is... And that, if you could have, you would have probably dropped at least four, five, maybe six mm -hmm. with all that going down. But uh, yeah, I never had the. Uh, I just didn't have the I dice mean, for it. I mean, and. I'm trying to figure out a mistake I made. I don't think I made one. Uh, yeah. Well, the only mistake you made was not remembering to put those guys in hard cover. They yeah. might not have been pinned. This whole well, thing would no, have been totally they, different. They would have been in hard cover once they were pinned the first time. They wouldn't have gotten oh. shoot up as badly. Yeah, that's true. Because uh, they did stop shooting at them eventually. Um, mm -hmm. but yeah, it was... Uh, if my force morale wasn't that too, I think I yeah. probably would have a chance to still win this thing. Because if I would have built up a, a chain of command dice or someone rolled a triple six, that is a huge force morale drop right there. Yeah, it is. Massive. Um, but I have no way to capitalize on it, so being it to myself, it's just going to take one lucky hit on a leader and then mm -hmm. it's game over. So, yeah, so it's uh, it was tough. Yeah, I mean... It was a tough game. It was a tough game. Just a weird map. <laughs> Not a lot of uh, cover. It's, There's well, a, it's a map that benefits the Soviets because it does. You you have to essentially do what I did. Yep. And I mean, you saw it. You had this squad hanging out here in the scrub on its own. And what do I roll? I roll three fives, a one, and a two. Yep, that's the dice. Yeah. They screw you over sometimes. Especially with the Russians, you don't have. So. Yeah, and I was just, we were talking a little bit earlier that uh, I would have tried to get in. I don't know if it would have been possible, but if I if we did the patrol phase over again, I would have tried to get this in here. I thought about it, but honestly... With those five free moves I had, that stopped, that put any, an end well, to that, essentially. Well, not, I mean, I was actually more interested in getting a jump off point over here than there, because I wanted you in that, pieces of you in that scrub, because I wanted to have essentially what happened where you've got that... One squad hanging out, and I can concentrate the entire platoon. Uh, you're not going to see me do valley. that. Well, you did. Well, because there was nothing on the board. Yeah. <laughs> I would have played a lot differently if there was a three squads of Soviets entrenched in well, here. I wouldn't have done I mean, that. <laughs> I, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. I would not have. I mean, you saw me. I never revealed my hand. Yeah, literally. They because. Stay back in the assembly area, guys. Look well, for it's, food. And, and that's on the Russians on the defense. You've got to keep hidden. And then just drop on them. Yeah, I would have loved to, because if I if I would have been able to get that up here, he wouldn't have enough space to, because he got on this just the width of this was enough to squeeze everything in. If I had this here, he would only be able to get about two units mm -hmm. there and one here. So I would definitely have an advantage then, because I could spread out with everything, and he would be. Of course, if you were set up in out. there. <laughs> Or he um, would be spread out. One of the things I would definitely take is a mortar, because that's just asking for a mortar attack. Yeah. Cool. Well, anyway, uh, thanks to Robert for coming over. and. Uh, uh, hey, I killed a German guy. He killed a German. Yeah, one German guy is dead. Yes. Three games in, he's killed the German. And wounded another. Yeah. So, Anyway, uh, as usual, thanks for watching, guys. I know this that first game was kind of weird, but sometimes campaign games go like that. That's just, that's just how Chain of Command works. And... The way the dice came out, that's just the way it goes. So um, it is what it is. And uh, 
let's say uh, thanks for watching guys check out our patreon page check out our facebook group and all that other good stuff that we have going on in social media and uh, let us know what you think of this game uh, gently <laughs> and uh, we'll see you guys next time